All right, Coach Harding, uh, you guys came back from Florida, and obviously outside of probably the weather, uh, what was it like to be down there and playing some baseball? Well, the weather was fantastic down there. You know, sunny, you know, low was about 72. So it was it was pretty tremendous. Uh, it was good to get on the baseball field and feel the ground ball on some dirt and uh, play the game that we love and, and get outside. The weather was tremendous, and... You know, we play on some really nice baseball fields down there too, so it's a it's a win win. You guys got you know first sweep in a while down there and picked up three wins. Just kind of talk about the you no know, the improvement or what you kind of saw that you were impressed with. Well, I, it's our best trip since uh, before two thousand and two, so we're really happy with that, and and we got a sweep as well, first one since two thousand and two, and. You know, I thought a lot of bright spots. We st five out of our uh, six starters down there was the first college start on the mound. So I thought we grew up pretty quickly and and uh, got some big wins. Uh, you know, for for the program and for us and for some of those guys in their first starts. Now you know you guys had you know what, ten games and. <laughs> You know, eight days or seven days, and you know now you get in a little bit more regular uh, schedule. You don't have to pitch everybody all the time. So, you know, what does that kind of do to kind of set you up for this upcoming if you come non-conference games as well as conference season starting up? Yeah, we can trim down the starting pitchers a little bit. So I I doubt we'll see some of those guys as starters on the mound uh, like we did down there. We figured some things out. Um, you know, it just kind of condenses things a little bit, but. All those games down there were sevens, and we get in the league, and they're all nines. So, you know, some of those guys have got to come out of the bullpen, and we'll be using all, our whole repertoire, obviously. Uh, but we do have 15 pitchers, and they'll all get some work throughout the year, even back home. But it won't be quite as much as, uh, on top of each other. And, you know, Luke Jorgensen went back-to-back uh, -back games. We'll still do that, but probably not three games in a week right. like, like we did down there. <laughs> Now, offensively, you guys had some, you know, some guys put up some good numbers and some clutch hits. Just kind of talk about that stuff down there. Yeah, it was nice to see. You know, it takes a little while for the offense to get going. We see that in the gym. Usually, the pitchers are a little dominant early, and then same thing went for us at the plate a little bit. It took us a little bit to get in the rhythm. You know, I think the first day we had eight or nine strikeouts in each game, and then we cut that down a lot and started putting it in play and. You know, Cody Rinke was Player of the Week in the conference with a bunch of doubles and RBIs, and Jake Schmitz is leading the team in hitting, and those guys busted out pretty good for us. And you know, we get on the base paths and can play our type of ball. It's, it's exciting and fun. Now you guys, you know, you guys have Concordia Moorhead on Wednesday, and then you open up conference play against Northland this weekend. So just kind of talk about as you transition now, now into the kind of the meat of your schedule here, the stuff that's getting to be pretty important. Yeah, uh, we go up to Concordia on Wednesday. You know, we didn't get that one in last year, so it's always nice to go play uh, my team and Bucky's in his last season. So that'll be kind of fun for me. That'll be the first time I get to coach against Bucky, and he's 12th all time and wins. So that's kind of a neat thing for me to get to do. And they've got all turf infield, so they're going to be ready to rock on Wednesday. We're just hoping the temperature is not <laughs> below freezing out there, but we'll find a way to. Uh, find a way to play some good baseball up there. And then we open up the season with Northland, and they've got a new coach, so it'll be a little different style uh, of baseball from them, I would imagine. And uh, we're excited to, to be at home, and hopefully we get some nice weather and get some people out to the park. And, you know, we're excited for the product we have. Like I said, we're young yet. We've got a lot of sophomores and, and freshmen playing um, in some key spots. and But we're going to grow up in a hurry and be – uh, you know, able to compete a little better than we have in the past, I think. All right, well, thanks for joining us, and like you said, hopefully that weather uh, gets to be a little better. It's supposed to be 50. I don't think we yeah. had 50 maybe all of last year until maybe <laughs> late in April. So. That's true. We were inside a lot longer. We've been on the turf once already, and, uh, you know, we didn't get out there but maybe twice last year, <laughs> so it's a nice break, and we're excited. Well, thank you. Thanks for having me.